I mean, it's such a, such a pleasure to have you here at the Canadian Embassy. You, uh, I was just, just so thrilled about uh, about your recent news and really quite proud I'll just to, to have this connection, be able to share this connection, particularly at this, this point in your life. So you're starting on a rave new adventure, and uh, we're just happy that uh, that we can go through this adventure together. So, but, uh, but maybe I could ask you just a, a couple of questions for... Uh, just that, uh, as you're starting off, and, uh, maybe you could tell us uh, a little bit about your, your motivations for uh, for studying in, in Canada. Why? Why can't? Well, first of all, thank you so much for uh, your help. Uh, why Canada? Because uh, Canada is a country of a uh, of cultural diversity, mm -hmm. so I guess it's a good uh, good choice. Also, it's a very uh, good for me to pursue my bachelor's degree, in computer science. In Toronto, so I'm looking forward to it. To this new experience, this new adventure, and I hope that it would be a good experience. No doubt for it with, and uh, I know with computer science too, you can do so many different things uh, in life. Really, with it, but what are your motivations behind uh, behind studying computer science to begin? With? Exactly, as you said, the computer science is like a tool that you can uh, use in uh, in any field you want. So uh, I'm thinking of uh, maybe uh, creating something that can help my country and the world to maybe uh, do something in medicine, in uh, economy, about problem solving. So I guess uh, this uh, field is uh, really interesting. Great, great. And, uh, and do, you, do you get a sense for uh, uh, what you'd like to bring back to Algeria someday from, from, your, from your studies? Do you... What what do you what do you most want to bring back? First, I need to come back as a scientist. Mm -hmm. So I can uh, add something to the country. I, as I said, uh, the country has many problems. We, we need to put our hands together to solve the country's problems. I like hope though, we would do this. Would love to you. You'd make a great Canadian ambassador to the Algerian because that's how I I view uh, part of my own role here is looking for ways for our, for us to help each other. Canada needs help. Uh, Algeria could stand uh, stand with some help, and uh, the more that we can help each other, the better. But uh, one thing I can't help you with from here is uh, is the Canadian winter. Do you do you know what's in store for you? I've made my research. Of course, yeah. Uh, so you have a big coat, the big boots. Not yet. I think it. <laughs> well, you've got a few a few months, so uh, uh, so so take your time and nerve prepare for this. Too. Mama, we're just so thrilled that uh, that we get to consider you as uh, as uh, one of our uh, adopted compatriots, and that uh, and I uh, just look forward to keeping this connection and, and to seeing all the wonderful things that the uh, live store for you, and everything you bring and bring to Canada and to Algeria. Congratulations! Yeah. Thank you, Marlo. So, um, 